Watching Cypher Chronicles on TV313.com. It's a kid skateboard, new album coming out, NERD, September 7th. It's called Nothing. Y'all about to watch Erica Badu, my neck. Be good. All right, good looking, baby. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Radio413.com, man. We down here at Shane Park with the multi-platinum winning, uh, the Grammy Award winning songstress, the beautiful, the sultry, the talented Miss Erica Badu, y'all. Welcome back to Detroit, baby. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. I love the D. And the D loves you. Yeah, now we have some little challenges here today. Now the show has been rescheduled for August the 12th, right? Yes. So August the 12th, back here at Shane Park. You're going to come back here and do a bit. Absolutely. All right. Now, real quick, I just kind of want you to speak a little bit. Right now, I mean, we're all experiencing challenging times, the economy, I mean, everything. Can you speak to the importance of overcoming adversity? I know you've been through some challenges in your life. And kind of talk to the young people about, you know, what you got from inside to get you over those times. Um, wow, that's a, that's a big thing. Adversity, getting over adversity. There's so many different kinds of um, humps for us to get over. I say, first, be honest about it. You know, be totally honest about what, what you're going through and own it. You know, nine times out of ten is the way we look at things. Look at here. Taking ownership of the situation and acknowledging yeah, yeah, it. Taking ownership of situations and acknowledging them. Can we still see? We got a little, a little more intimate. Uh, it's okay. We're going to keep it rolling. All right. Lights, camera, action. Let's do it. We in the D now. Y'all make sure everything is all right. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Lock that door. <laughs> hey, she said, hey, y'all, uh, hey, lock the door, y'all. Let's get the X-Men out here. Yeah. Okay, we're going we gonna to wrap it up here. Miss Eric with Badu, y'all. You watch the TV313.com. We getting it in. Cypher Chronicles. Yeah. Well, um. To answer the question, the question is a very important one. Uh, how do we overcome adversity? In my opinion, and I'm no expert on anything, I just know a couple of things. And one thing that I do know is that we should totally own uh, what it is that we are going through. We should definitely be honest about uh, what role we play in the adversity and not wait for uh, someone to make a move or stop doing something in order for us to be able to do something. You know, we can we can move any kind of way we want to. And when you see it something not moving, change the way you're thinking. Because adversity listens to thinking. And um, when you're listening uh, to yourself and communicating that to whatever hurdle is in the way, it begins to disperse. And I've seen it happen. I've seen that happen. And... Um, I, I I encourage others to try that as an experiment. When you don't see any other way around a hurdle, a hump, a wall, a mountain, then change the way you think about it. Change the way you see the mountain and um, walk through it. And to move out of your way. And I've seen you on stage, Eric. I mean, you go out there and I mean, you just leave the whole thing out there. You have such a complete experience. Where does your passion come from to go out there and just leave it on the stage like that every time? Um, I think my job as an artist is just to be totally honest because it's therapy for me, whether you guys know it or not. It's, it's how I uh, get by. I'm not a smoker or a drinker. Or ain't no pills that can help what I'm trying to do. There's no, you know, ain't no happiness drug that can do what I'm trying to do. So I uh, choose to go through it. Total, total conscious, totally conscious, and I, um, I appreciate everyone giving me an opportunity to be who I am, and uh, that's my drug, the art, that's my religion. I love him. I appreciate you taking time to talk with us. Uh, once again, you guys, the concert has been rescheduled for August the 12th here at Shane Park. Um, contact the box office. Um, we appreciate you, Erica. We love yeah, you. Yeah, and the whole band will be nude. Oh. And the band, hey, y'all, and the band will be nude. And Erica will have on six-inch stiletto. I will. All right. Hey, y'all, TV313.com, y'all. We out. Holler.